Hello guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Brooke and today we're going to be doing a giant, giant Shop Disney haul and unboxing. Um, I went a little crazy and I spent so much money. Like, I, I am ashamed of how much money I spent. And if you know, shipping Shop Disney items to Canada is actually terrible. Like, the shipping price is astronomical. Uh, so, <laughs> this is going to be a definitely one-time thing. However, I purchased so much stuff because the shipping is so much. I literally paid $60 in shipping and $60 in duties just to get this stuff here. Um, I did split it with my family also, so I mean that definitely did help quite a bit. However, uh, still quite pricey. So one time thing, but I'm very excited to get into it. So this here is the box it all came in. So I got a couple things, and then as you can see, there are also definitely wishables in here. Um, if you do not know what wishables are, I'm literally obsessed with them. Disney comes out with one new collection every month, and I'm kind of obsessed with them. So I'll go over like the regular stuff, and then we can get into wishables, because uh, there are a lot of wishables. <laughs> So, very first off, um, I got the 2020 grad cap. My parents were nice enough to buy this for me. Um, if you do not know, I am almost, almost done college. I'm in my currently last semester of actual schooling right now. I finish in August, um, and I will not be getting any sort of graduation. So, I got the Disney 2020 ears. They say class of 2020 on the side. They're really adorable. They're super sparkly. They have a little cap. They're really cute. We can move the tag. But yeah, I, I kind of really love them. They're really cute. They're perfect. I mean, honestly, better than a real grad cap. And then the next thing I got here, um, I opened it up already. It wasn't like bubble wrap in another box, but it is a mug and this is the 2020 Flower and Garden mug. I was going to pick this up when I was in Florida before, actually at the Flower and Garden Festival, but I just did not um, and highly regretted it after. But it is a mug that looks like a flower pot. It has a little corn handle, Mickey's on this side, um, and it's like a whole photo of Epcot and all that. And then on the other side it says Flower and Garden Festival 2020. And I'm not gonna use this as a mug. I am actually going to plant a succulent in here because I love the idea that this is a planter made to use as a mug, but I'm gonna use it as a planter. I think it's gonna look absolutely adorable. Um, I know there are succulents you can get that don't necessarily need sunlight, which is great because I'm in the basement and I'm going to have it as my little succulent baby and this is just like the perfect size for that and I am so obsessed and so excited to go pick out a succulent. So next is all wishables. And let's talk a little bit about wishables because I know a lot of people watching this are probably not wishable collectors. Um, so let's talk a little bit about wishables before we open them. So basically, with wishables, every month Disney comes out with these mystery bags and there are four different characters that you can get possibly in this mystery bag. You don't know what it is, but you can like squeeze it and feel it to find out. And then on top of the mystery bags, there is one single non-hidden character that you can get. So this here is a country bear bag, for example. So the four characters you can get are Henry, Teddy Bear, Baby Oscar, Bunny, Bubbles, and Beulah. There is an extra. So Big Al is the opened edition one as the extra. So usually together there are five. However, recently Disney implemented different alternative ones that you can get. So the best example is like, I'll, I'll put a photo of one in right here. But basically there's the four and then there are different versions of those four that you can get. So usually there's like one or two extra ones of Flower and Garden. They had three different types of Frushi, even though only one was advertised on the package. Um, with the Country Bears one, you can get Bunny, Bubbles, and Beulah. Each look different. Um, their eyes are open and closed. So technically, instead of having the four hidden ones, there are six hidden ones. Additionally, with the Monsters Inc. ones, um, there are four regular ones, plus Roz up here. There is a alternate version of her as well. So if you're wondering how many wishables I actually purchased, I purchased 12 hidden ones. They only sent me 11 because unfortunately Country Bears, they had one less than what I actually ordered, so I'm getting a refund on that one. Um, and then opened editions, I purchased three. So in total, there are 14 wishables here. I own five wishables currently right now in perspective so I am about to literally quadruple my collection. Now you're also probably wondering 
why in the world I would order nine country bear wishables because that seems a little crazy like I'm gonna have duplicates um, however what you might not know is just like pins and that there are Facebook groups out there where people who have duplicates like trade them with each other or sell them off or something um, so that they can make their collection full and whole without actually having to just keep purchasing more and then having all these duplicates um, so any duplicates I plan on either trading or selling in those Facebook groups so let's go with the open edition ones first what I got so first off I got the flower and garden Mickey Mouse one and this is so cute. He's wearing a little flower apron. He's holding a little apple. It looks like he's just adorable. It's all like these pastel colors. It's actually the same Mickey that's on the mug here. Just the little wishable version of him. He's so cute. Like I put him in the mug before. Like look how cute he is just like sitting in his mug. I adore that. I then got Donald and look how angry he is. He's so angry and grumpy. Oh he's Donald is like my number one. Look how grumpy he is. <laughs> and then as you guys already saw, the last open edition I got is the Country Bear Big Al. Um, so this is the open edition of that. He's just holding his guitar um, in his little sweater vest thing here and has this little hat on. Okay, so let's open the Monsters Inc. ones first. So I got two of the Monsters Inc. ones and in the Monsters Inc. set you can get Boo, Mike Wazowski, the Mo Metropolis, Monstropolis? What? the Monstropolis Transit Authority Taxi and Roz. Now Roz, I said, has the double. Um, I really, the only one that I, the only reason I didn't order like more of these is because I didn't want the taxi or like multiples of the taxi. However, I'm feeling this one is very, very thick. So I don't know. I mean, it is what it is. And I'm as long as I both are the taxi, I'm gonna be happy. Okay, so. I have high hopes that this, there's a chance this might be my possessed. Oh, another fun thing about Wishables is everyone likes to feel the bags. Um, so I'm going to do some ASMR with you and probably feel all the bags and guess what they are. Yes! Yes! Oh, that makes me so happy. I was so concerned. He's so fluffy and cute. Oh, that makes me so, so happy. I also low-key have this weird thing about keeping all of these bags, um, so that's the hoarder in me. Okay, and the next one. I mean, this one could potentially be the taxi too, but it's very thin, and I feel like the taxi would be a little bigger. But feeling it out, I'm gonna guess... I'm gonna guess that it's Boo. We have a second Mike Wazowski. That's okay. Like I said, I can trade them. Okay, so Country Bears. There are none of these that I don't want. I would love to be able to get the whole collection of these, which is why I ordered all of them. I don't even know what to feel for because they're all bears and they're pretty much all wearing hats. So let's just open it up. <laughs> and first, right off the bat, we have Teddy Bear. Oh, she's so cute. I love her. I love her feather boa. Next, this might be Henry. Oh, yes. We have one of the three Bunny Bubbles and Beulah, and this is the one with the winky eye. So the one advertised on the package here has two eyes open, so this is one of the like specialer ones. Next in the bin. And we have baby Oscar. This is going very well so far. I'm kind of scared for this. Okay, we have three different ones, which is awesome. Next up. Oh, oh, we have another one of these. And eyes open. Yes. Okay, out of nine, we right now have four different ones. I'm scared. This is like on edge. Like. Oh my gosh, if we can get a Henry and one more of the blue bonnet ones here, I will classify that as a full set. If I have some with duplicate eyes, I'm okay with that. Please be Henry, please be Henry, please be Henry. Ah, uh, our first duplicate, we have another teddy bear. And we have four more left. And another baby Oscar. 
three left. Another bonnet. Okay, we got our three bonnets. This one has the eyes closed. I got all three different ones. That is so perfect. Oh my gosh. Okay, I did not expect that at all. They're all three different ones. I thought if anything, we would get duplicates of these ones, but no. That's so perfect. If I can get Henry and get the full set in these last two. I got the full, that does not happen. Like that is so rare. This is, people don't know, okay? Disney is so good. Like literally I saw one lady post the other day. She got like 10 teddy bears when she got, when she ordered 10. Disney does not sort them out that way. I can't believe I got the whole set. I got the whole set. Oh, that makes me so happy. Let's open the last one just for kicks. See what we got here. And we have another teddy bear. I feel like no one quite understands how literally lucky I am that we managed to get the full set. That is so crazy. I am a little disappointed that we didn't get two different Monsters Inc. ones because I only ordered two. It kind of sucks that they were both exactly the same. However, having the full set of the country bears with the different eyes in one go, wow. Okay, so out of that, we only have four duplicates, which is great, and I am very happy with that. That is all I ordered in my Shop Disney order. Um, I am so happy. This worked out so well. I'm, I'm so happy. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you did enjoy this unboxing and all the wishables, and I am literally obsessed with wishables. I, I literally love wishables so much. It's such a bad fad but I mean like I'm not obsessed with pins or anything like literally so I mean I'm I'm allowed this um thank you guys so much for watching this video make sure you give it a thumbs up if you haven't already go check out my channel and subscribe because I post new Disney videos all the time so thank you again so much for watching and have a magical rest of your day